<laughs> oh, these guys are nasty. Oh, incoming. <coughs> now they want a third of your hit point. Uh, see, bleed's useless. I can't make him bleed. This does more total damage, but it spreads it out over three different guys. And we want to knock these Arbyists out as fast as we can. We try to dump these two. Crowd control a little bit. Good job, Goo. Oh my death waits. For the Hang in there, Goo. Yeah, Goo's at death's door. When you drop to zero hit points, you're basically making saving throws, trying not to die. So yeah, we'll have uh, Star Squeak go ahead and throw a, a heal on uh, Guru. Oh, Mortality stop critting! Ouch! A single strike. Oh my goodness gracious me. Alright, Sirkin, please take him out. Thank you. Sirkin, holy moly! I almost feel guilty about that. <laughs> okay, we're down to just the last one, and he's out of position, so he can't do too much damage. Just assuming he's, you know, doesn't crit again. And now we just hit him with all our best attacks and try to drop him as fast as we can. Oh, I've had the worst luck with missing and dodging. Hooray! A trifling victory. Oh. <laughs> but a victory nonetheless. <laughs> oh, that wasn't the end of the dungeon yet. Anyway. Yeah. If, if computer role playing games have taught me anything, fountains always heal you. Oh. Or we find money in the bottom of the fountain. Alright. We're all. Everyone's banged up, but we're hanging in there. Well, everyone except Star Squeak. She's good at not taking damage. Oh, well, we finally got a scout check. <sighs> so we're going to have to get through another fight on our way there. Okay. Yeah, we'll snag us a torch. Which we might as well use. And the light, I think we're almost the promise of here. safety. Yeah, we will use the last of our medicinal herbs. Find some more crests. All right, now we got a fight coming up. Ooh, I don't know. Have some. You can eat food to heal, but you don't heal much. And I've only got four left, and I'd hate to get hit with a starve random event and not have it. So, we're just going to hope for the best. Oh, gosh. At least we surprised them. Just getting all stressed out. Oh, oh. Sirkin, no, hang in there. Uh, 
sure they don't need to throw a big heel on the circuit or we risk putting him on death's door. It might be enough to take him out. Yes! Oh, but he missed him. Okay, oh, good. Uh, Guru uh, can use Battlefield Medicine to heal that bleed. And give him a little more hit points. I mean, it's not much. Uh, it's certainly not worth doing just for the hit point heal. Oh, Zirkin! Stop missing! Oh, knife in the dark! Oh, it too, Brute. Oh, nice shooting pass. Uh, let's go ahead and sandbag this a bit and try to get another heal off before we have to call it quits. This is probably not a good idea, but... I don't want to go in that last fight at, you know, as low as we were. Okay, that was worth it. That was totally worth it. Uh, we'll keep doing that. Oh, heck with it. Yeah, finish the fight. All right, we're we're actually not too bad. As off. victories mount, so yeah. too will resistance. We're not too bad off. I think uh, I think we can handle whatever lies up ahead. Porch level is just still fine. Nothing. Oh, okay. So we gotta go through the entire place then. Alright. Last hallway and last room. Oh! Well, at least it was Dark's imagination spring to life. She can heal herself. Purpose. And she had the most hit points, so yeah. That had to happen. Oh, and that's there goes the last of our food. I'm so glad I hung on to that. There's just you know might as well just burn torches whenever. We actually have you know, I brought too many. I brought more than we needed. Oh, a map. Thanks for that. Where was that? Three rooms ago. All right. Well, it looks like we're clear all the way to the door, and then we yeah, we got <laughs> got a fight on our hands. Well. No one lives forever. Although another day would be nice. Oh, we didn't surprise him, and oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, I don't. I don't. Ow, ow, ow. That was lucky. That was actually a really low roll for that attack. Come on, put a bleed on him. Yes. Crowd control these two. Oh, good job, Sirkin. And let's keep up with the crowd control. There we go. And by the time he recovers, yeah, he's. I might as well ignore him from here on out. By the time he recovers, he that bleed will finish him. So now let's concentrate on bringing down the bone defender. Aye. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Alright. Let's bring down the alkalite. Uh, let's, uh, let's just really stack that on there. Okay, she is finished. Oh, couldn't get lucky forever. Oh, but he good. He resisted the stun and the knockback. All right, let's bring on the hurt and circuit. Okay. Okay, now he can't use coral anymore. He is buffed against stuns at the moment, so um, actually, you know, let's just concentrate on healing a little bit. Oh, well, wow. oh, that was nice. Do more damage, or do we? Yeah, let's crowd control. Stun. Alright. 
focus fire, hit him with all our best attacks. Whoa! Ah. Smite! Goodbye! Alright, so now we just got this lone bone head to deal with. <sighs> yeah, bring him down! I think we're gonna pull this off. Yeah, we just hit him with it, or as much damage as we can. And smite for the win. Game set. This expedition at least kind of promises here. success. Oh. oh, nice. Kind of a cool item. Oh, gee, thanks. I found some food. Just in time to finish the quest. Anyway, and we're done. We click that, and head back to town. Four bones return to rest. Nice little Devils summary of everything we found. We did all right. Uh, I figure we invested about uh, two to three thousand in, in provisions and came out of there with close to eight thousand. And all these relics we can use to upgrade the town with. What we really need right now are more of these. But, well. And guys gain a little XP. You only gain XP for completing quests, by the way. So, yeah, you can't just go in, run a few rooms and escape and, and get anywhere. Alright, Star Squee gains evasive. Well, that offsets the clumsy. Ironic. Uh, oh, no. Oh, that's not good. I'm scared of the ruins. But, you know, I'm less likely to be pushed off balance. And... Sirkin is an amateur weaponsmith. That'll be important later when we unlock the blacksmith. And Guru, yeah, the guy who came closest to dying is the only one who didn't come out of there with a phobia or a mania. How about that? And we head back to town. I was gonna quit, but you know, I'll quickly run, run through what the Abbey and the Tavern do. Now hit point damage does not carry over. They got, you know, these guys got a week to rest up. So, but you see, our stress damage does carry over. That stays with you until you get blow it off somehow. Um, that's what the Abbey and the Tavern are both for stress relief. The cobwebs have been dusted. The pews Go set straight. Uh, and this guy, the, the caretaker, he will use one of these services every single week, which is really irritating, especially when he takes transept. And the uh, Sirkin, if you remember right, is God fearing. So the only way he can relieve stress is that one. Luckily, he actually came through with all his marbles intact. So, but we'll have, um, yeah, we'll send Star Squeak off to meditate for a while. And we can upgrade the Abbey here using uh, crests and busts. I should have done that before. Oh well. And Goo. Yeah, Goo's pretty stressed out. Yeah, that near death experience. Fresh heads, cards, and curtained rooms promise solace to the weary and oh, broken boy. alike. Yeah, we'll throw some With enough upgrades ale, on that. Maybe they can be inured against the horrors below. And we'll go ahead and let Goo drink until until he forgets all about his uh, bad experiences. Fresh bunch of fools waiting. Uh... <laughs> They're always so cocky when I first pick them up. Fresh bunch of fools. And we'll go ahead and pull them, uh, pull them off the stage coach. Now we'll get a little choosier later once we fill up the roster. We'll probably send some of these guys packing and replace them with better. Oh, we did not find any more deeds, so we can't upgrade the stagecoach anymore. I'll go ahead and rename these guys in the next episode. And for now, I'm going to call that a night. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Ciao!